In today's video, we will look at the 9,000-year-old mummies, an elongated alien skull found in South America. But let's start with the huge mammoth remains found frozen in ice. A complete female mammoth body was recently discovered in Russia's Nelly of Scree Islands. But not only was the skeleton complete, but the flesh, muscle, and fur were still attached to the body. This mammoth was found trapped under a layer of pure ice and is said to be 42,000 years old. At first sight, this woman encased in ice may not appear to be particularly frightful, but her tail may send shivers down your spine. This mummy was discovered about 20,000 feet above sea level on the lip of a volcano, surrounded by what was most likely her children. She was so well preserved that lice were still found in her hair, according to reports. After examining her body, it was discovered that her tribe sacrificed her to the volcano due to her numerous illnesses. Because her body was well preserved, doctors were able to infer her various diseases, providing a window into her life. Found thousands of feet deep in the ice, this weird skull dumbfounded everyone who saw it. The researchers ran various tests on this elongated skull specimen that was discovered in South America. Scientists are confused about the origin of it, and many think it could be the sign of an alien visitor extraterrestrial presence. After elongated skulls, let's move to elongated snouts. The weather in North Carolina in January 2019 was so low that even the lakes and tiny ponds froze in less time, causing the Swamp Park and Ocean Isle Beach authorities to be concerned about their 18 American alligators held in the park, and their concern was understandable. So when they went in to check on those alligators, they were pleasantly surprised to see that their snouts were poking out of the frozen ice block, and their entire bodies were under the ice. But the best part was that they were all alive. As soon as the frozen ice block was broken, those gators went about their business as if nothing had happened. Isn't it amazing? Two buddies were strolling around a frozen lake when they came across this strange construction in the middle of it. Small holes can be seen poking through the ice, revealing a peculiar pattern beneath, which the two assumed that this was something aliens left behind when they visited Earth. The texture of the supposed eggs is described as slimy by the two because they didn't bring anything with them. Others say it is the site of a UFO landing. Many people believe the eggs are from another planet. The melting of the ice caps poses greater risks than we are aware of because the ice is uncovering new viruses that have been frozen in time. Only a few years ago, a lethal virus was discovered a few hundred feet beneath the tundra of Siberia, and it was still active because the virus is over 30,000 years old, and there's no known cure because of how old it is. Because of that, the virus and its immense size was given the name Pathos. It is thought to be the world's largest virus. A dog species was discovered a few years ago, and biologists believe it dates back 10 centuries. The animal was well preserved due to the freezing conditions, and it's thought to be among the first breeds of dogs to be tamed. Early evidence of wolves being domesticated and progressively converting into charming dogs has been discovered in research on this species today's household pets. Mummies were discovered in the Russian town of Selikart in the Zelen Ur burial site. Archaeologists discovered two mummies, one an adult lady and the other a baby. The mummies are estimated to be 900 years old and are said to be part of an undiscovered medieval culture. The fact that the female mummy is the lone female in the burial ground has led some to believe she was a member of society's upper crust. When a mysterious pyramid-like building was photographed in Antarctica in 2016, the internet went crazy. Some believe the humans had inhabited Antarctica and built pyramids like the Egyptians, while conspiracy theorists went straight to aliens. The whole thing was creepy and bizarre, even though the explanation of it might turn out to be boring. I get the feeling that it may just be a mountain peak. Green Boots, a dead climber, was once seen being held behind a rock where he died, wearing green boots, and is said to have remained there for several months until his body was taken one day by someone or something. Green Boots' fate is unknown, but many believe he was simply removed for proper burial. In 1959, a geologist named Paul T. Walker decided to look into the melting of glaciers, so he concealed a note in a bottle among rocks near a glacier, asking the finder to estimate the distance between the bottle and the glacier's edge. The ice encased bottle was discovered in 2013 by two academics. They made the decision to follow Walker's directions. 
Despite the fact the glacier was discovered only five decades after Walker's letter, the stunning discoveries revealed that it had receded nearly 200 feet. This indicates that global warming is real and that it is an issue that requires immediate attention. Hunters traveling across Siberia in 2014 discovered this well-preserved creature. At first, they mistook the body for that of a dead reindeer, but upon closer inspection, they realized that it was a rhinoceros. They decided to transfer the rhino's body and conserve it until the season changed, at which point the body was moved to the Academy of Sciences. Sasha is one of the few healthy woolly rhinos discovered. Despite the fact that not all of Sasha was intact, presumably due to predators, the intact section supplied scientists with valuable information about the creature's past. A squirrel dug a plant called Silene stenophila in 2012, according to reports. What the squirrel didn't realize was that the Ice Age had arrived for him and the rest of the planet, and that he'd been down there for far longer than he'd anticipated. The depth to which the squirrel dug these plants was sufficient to act as a freezer, storing these previously unknown plants for decades. Scientists can use the results reached by extracting these plants from frozen tundra to help them discover evolutionary chains that lead to the plants we know today. Many experts said it was a bad idea for the late 19th century Swedish balloonist essay on Judea to attempt to reach the North Pole by hot air balloon, but optimism and nationalistic pride drove him to reject their cautions. He and two companions set out in July 1897 and were never heard from again. Their remains were discovered in 1930 by an expedition studying nearby glaciers. We're not sure whether this is heartbreaking or terrifying. Iceland's Vanta Glacier is Europe's second largest ice cap, spanning about 8% of the country. Underneath glaciers are massive ice caverns with ceilings and walls that look like giant waves frozen in time that are actually created by geothermal springs. It's surreal and it's gorgeous, but it's also a little unsettling. Talk about feeling claustrophobic. The frozen remains of a 50,000-year-old cave lion cup dating back to the previous ice age were discovered in Russia's far northern Yukusa, which is the heart of Siberia, where the ground is continuously frozen and temperatures fall below minus 60 degrees Fahrenheit during severe winters. According to Russian specialists, the cup was roughly a year old when the remains were discovered. Lions in Siberia became extinct about 10,000 years ago, and only a few tracks and bones have been discovered. This newly discovered specimen is so well preserved that you can see its facial features and its head was resting on its paw. The remains are in excellent condition for their age, and because they are so well preserved, there are hopes that the remains can be used to clone the animal. Rabbits can wander to far off places and can even get stuck in the most unfavorable weather too. As these natives of Kazakhstan, a hairy little fellow froze to death. The bunny looks like he is a stuffed animal placed in the bushes on purpose, but no, it's a real thing. And now let us move on to our subscriber pick of the day. This image was sent to us by one of our subscribers. Similarly, if you ever wish to know more about an image you come across, just send it out over to us. Who knows, we might even feature it in one of our videos. It was a cold December night in Lingby, Minnesota, when 19-year-old Jean Hillard was returning late to her parents' house when her family car skidded off the icy road. She was wearing western boots, a coat, and mittens when she got out of the car and began walking to her neighbor Wally Nelson's house, which was two miles away from where she had lost control of the car. The next morning at 7 a.m., she dropped about 15 feet from his door. Mr. Nelson discovered her completely frozen in the snow, rushing her to the hospital. According to the doctor who revived her, Dr. George Sadler, who treated the young woman, she may have to lose a couple of her toes. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again.